So guys, what I want to talk about today is a new strategy, a new property investment strategy called rent vesting. And as the name suggests, it involves doing two things. It involves going out there and renting your primary place of residence wherever you want. Go and live wherever you want and wherever you can afford. Somewhere where you can change, somewhere where you're not tied down. If you do go out there and get that job promotion, you do want to pack up and go overseas, you do meet that special person and decide to move in with them uh, or to start a family, you can do that while you're renting. But at the same time, it involves you going out and investing in a property because it makes financial sense. So you're separating your primary place of residence from your investment, from the numbers and from the tax strategy. And this is very, very important and more and more young people are doing this because they're finding it difficult to enter the property market while maintaining their lifestyle. You know, in Sydney, Brisbane, Melbourne and a lot of the other major capital cities, um, people in their 20s or 30s are used to socialising, uh, going and studying in a certain place, working uh, right in the heart of town and yet when they come to invest they're finding it very difficult to invest in an area that they want to live in and so what the smart investors are doing is they're separating that they're separating where you live your primary place of residence from where you invest and that's what rent vesting means now some advantages so the first one I spoke about the choices that you have and the flexibility that it gives you to chop and change and move without being tied down with a huge mortgage in your primary place of residence. The second is very important and it's around tax strategy. Now if you're working earning good bucks what you take home and what you keep is after tax. So tax strategy is very important. If you don't have a tax strategy in place, if you don't have tax effective investments in place, you're really missing out. And your primary place of residence, if you were to go out and take out a huge mortgage and live in that home, your expenses are not tax deductible. When it's an investment property, it is. So all your interest, uh, all your strata, your council, your water, your maintenance, your insurances, your depreciation, that starts to all add up and become very tax effective for you. So you are paying rent, but at the same time you're collecting rent on an investment property and that becomes tax effective strategy for you. So it's a very convenient way uh, to enter the market. The, the, the advantages are that you're not tied down, you can grow your portfolio, you can start becoming more savvy and tax effective. But what we do uh, to a lot of people that come in and speak to our advisors is we put this all up on the screen. Okay, so we visualize it and we show you what it means, what the two different scenarios will mean for you from an after-tax perspective, from a weekly perspective. And it's only at that point where we put it up that people have that aha moment. Okay, they're really taken back by the huge financial advantage that rent investing gives you. So it's something to consider. There'll be more notes on the video page uh, that you're watching this from. Contact our team, speak to us, find out how this works, how it can work for you. If you're young and you're looking at entering the market, and even if you're not young, okay, even if you're old and you haven't entered the market, it doesn't matter because this strategy can be very effective for you. You can live where you want, you can party with who you want, uh, you, can, you can meet who you want um, and also be in the market and invest outside of where you're living in a tax effective way and in a way where your money's growing and not tied down in your primary place of residence which is not tax effective. Speak to our team, I'd love to visualize this for you and show you how it works and help you out with your journey.